So the development of the Align PJK brace came about because of the results of the preliminary study utilizing a hyperextension Jewett brace. What I've noticed is that patients did not find it very comfortable, although some did, uh, but it was overall uh, very mixed in regards to post-operative uh, compliance due to issues uh, such as uh, sitting down, for example, where the brace would ride up and start to hit the patient's chin and be very uncomfortable. And also uh, the way that the posterior portion of the hyperextension brace was really irritating the surgical site. So we, want, we thought that we could make improvements to the design uh, to make it uh, more friendly for, for the patient to use. Uh, and therefore increase compliance and potentially uh, uh, improve and mitigate the risk of developing junctional kyphosis. One of the things we also wanted to do is have a better restriction of motion. Uh, and that's one of the things that we were able to accomplish if we look at the components that make up the Align Brace as it being an evolution and an improvement from the Jewett Brace. It's all of those elements, not only the posterior portion, but also the anterior portion and how that sits for the patient when they stand up and they sit down, and also being more restrictive on the flexion moment of the spine above the area where the fusion has happened.